Some students at Orchard Knob Elementary now know a little bit more about how their food gets on the dinner table. They're using a special production system called aquaponics to grow strawberries and tomatoes. But that's not all they're doing. WDEF News Show's chief photographer David Moore has another example of what's right with our schools. Let's start very, very gently. Like this? Mm -hmm. We are filling our community's food bucket. I'm going to dig just a little bit deeper, right? This was a, a project that we undertook in the fall. The Junior League was offering a mini grant, and we were awarded $1,500 from the Junior League of Chattanooga to put together the system. We contacted Hatponics, Ryan Cox over at Hatponics. He built the system with the help of his staff, and they have just now installed it. I'm going to move real gently because these are rocks, you know, and we, this, this, the plant is real fragile. It's great because a lot of kids especially in the inner cities don't really understand where their food comes from so this allows them to learn firsthand and experience growing their own food oh, wow. great great that's right good job we will be able to offer fresh fish we will be able to offer fruits and vegetables during the winter months today we planted strawberries and tomatoes and since orchard knob elementary falls in a, a food desert, then we will be able to help provide that. If you get strawberries, you can make stuff with it, like, um, you can, um, make a pie. And when you eat healthy stuff, you say, you say, you get lots of energy. You have to eat good and don't eat all those sweets. This is something that our children are learning how to give back to others and how to help provide for the citizens of our community. Good job, Orchard Knob. Hey, if you got an idea for a story, go to our website. It's WDEF.com. That's where you can find the icon that says What's Right With Our Schools, and you'll find a link to post your story idea.